the gods have not abandoned us. We must, we must, we must go quickly now. Take me to Delphi. We have much to discuss. But give me this. Yeah, it's a little paranoid, but I like them. Just give him a couple seconds so he can run over here to his chest and grab his shit. No. No. And now as we leave, more shit happens. It's more shit code. You know what? With my lock picking at max, I can literally What are you doing, man? Anyways, I can literally drop all these extra picks, because I don't need them no more. Suddenly teleporting on top of me? How are you doing? I thought I killed all of you. Whatever. This guy is actually pretty good at varying for himself, so you don't really have to worry about him. It's the other guy that you do have to worry about, especially if you're playing on master difficulty like me. They will kind of, they'll kind of rip through his health pretty damn quickly. It's not fun. Not fun for anyone. Well, it may, may, maybe for me, but that's only because I find things like that kind of laughably macabre. What about you viewers? Do y'all find things like that laughably macabre? Or do y'all even know what macabre means in the first place? Whatever the occasion is, it don't matter. Everybody will still die by my hand. And it's okay. I'm the thing. Wrong way. I was gonna do something. I don't know. Oh well. Once we get him out of that pit anyways, he will be just, li literally just fine. be kind of careful about that one viewers sometimes he'll glitch and not appear right after you leave an area so if you fast travel without him appearing he'll actually disappear for good and you gotta reload a previous save 
so be careful about that. It's a glitch, it's annoying, just be careful. Also, I've been told something about this right here. You see how all of those have Lich Masks? Apparently that's a Dragon Shout you can only get after defeating each Lich and taking their mask for yourself. So I'm going to keep my, keep, keep my eye out on that one. I haven't seen it yet, but I'm going to do it anyways. See, see, what it, see, see what goes on. Delphi, huh. it's good to see you. It's been Don't look at me. Look at them. It's good to see you too, Esper. It's been too long, old friend. Too long. Well, then, you made it safe and sound. Why are you looking good. at me? Come on. I, I don't like being looked at. I'm going to stab you both. Hold down the bar for a minute, will you? Yeah, sure. This way. Now, something to note, viewers, my next recording set will actually be me exploring one of the dungeons. One of the dungeons that requires you to pick up a claw to go through. Because I feel like going through one of them. I don't know which one. I only know where two are right now. But I'm going to do it anyway. Now then, I assume... Let's see what Esbern has to say. But yeah, just let these two talk. Oh yes, Dragonborn, indeed. Yes. Oh, this changes everything, of course. There's no time to lose. We must locate this. Let me show you. I know I had it. Esbern, what? Uh, let's see. Me just a moment. Oh. I think I'll go to now, Reachwater is. Rock first. You see, right here, Skyhaven Temple. Structured around one of the main Akabiri military camps in the reach during their conquest in the sky. Possibly. You know what he's talking about? Alduin's Wall. I think I've got it discovered. Yeah, I'm Whether pretty sure. They recorded all they knew of Alduin and his return. Part history, part prophecy. His location has been lost for centuries. But I have found it. So let's accept this guy's request, and you know what? So I'm just waiting for next recording set. I'm just going to go on and go to Reachwater Rock right after this time. Now where can I find this dude? This is what I've been trying to explain. It's in the Sky Haven Temple, an ancient blade sanctuary. The blade sanctuary also has a tomb, if I do remember. If I'm remembering correctly. Okay. So now we've got our next mission for that guy. Let's see if I can find Reach Water Rock. Are you following me? They're both following me. God damn it. They're making me come over here. Well, there's Reachwater Rock. <laughs> wow. Okay. I was not expecting that one. <laughs> I was actually not expecting that. One, to find it so soon, because I knew I had it discovered, I just didn't know where it was. I was expecting to have to search through the entire map. 
so since we're here, let's go into Reachwater Rock. It's hidden behind a waterfall. Now, I do have the combinations to both Reachwater Rock and Young Gold Boro, I want to say. It's Y N G O L Boro. So, yeah. Come on up here. And we've got the Emerald Dragon Claw. Well, this guy seems dead. And he ain't got shit on you. So we've got this door. Now, I believe what my note down was from top to bottom Dragon. Fish. Not dragon. Bear, fish, snake. Add the emerald. And there we go. Now, this is what I've. One of the things I've been doing off screen is open. Is finding these places and opening their doors. Figuring out just. Oh boy. I forgot the second set of doors. <sighs> oh boy. That was gonna be fun. Alright, viewers, you know what? Tell y'all what. I'll meet y'all back here once I get the combination to this door, because it's gonna take me quite some time to figure it out, most likely. And before I do that, though, let's go on and show you the consequences of answering this door wrong. Okay. I guess not! Anyways, you see on the side there's these. Yeah, you can be... If you answer that door wrong right there, it'll uh, sort of it's sort of booby traps. So I guess I'll have to come back here. Oh well. Make sure to still hold on to your emerald dragon claw, though, viewers. Because you may have to use it for something else. I'm not allowed to be in there yet. Let's go this way. How you doing, Shadowmere? Let's go for a ride. This way. Fuck you, Dongard! Oh god, Shadowmere is so goddamn slow at swimming. Sorry, Shadowmere, but you can't swim in this current. You're worthless. You're worthless. You are totally worthless to me right there. And at times like this, I'm wishing that I had the computer version of this game, because I could put in mods, one of them being the Blink Teleport mod. It was a mod released about the same time as Dishonored that using either Magic or Shout it does exactly as it sounds. In an instant you teleport. Hi, Dragon!
By the way, you're dead now. I think every single time I've come here, there's been a dragon flying around. No more dragons. God damn it. I think that dragon's supposed to be scripted, basically. By the way, a bit of hilarity here. If you can manage to pickpocket these guys, you can literally remove their hearts. I find that kind of funny. By the way, that's a storm astronaut. That's no bueno. And since these guys have become plot characters now, they will only go unconscious when their health is depleted, so you don't have to pay attention to them at all. Oh boy. Hooray for one way invisible wall. I remember this place. I also remember I didn't like it. I get so horribly lost here. You have this symbol for king and warrior. All right. I think that's literally what I ended up doing, just... Get them all the same... thing. There we go. And... Nope. Try... every potential combo nation. Too long. Actually, fairly impressed with myself. Oh boy. This place, you need to follow the line. Even if you have the ability to not set off traps by walking on these buttons. It'll still set off the trap if you step on the wrong thing. However, you can just pull that, and now the trap has been deactivated. Money's gold ingot and worthless to me. Gotta wait for this guy to get up Money. here. Remarkably well preserved. Here 
Here's the blood seal. Another of lost vocabulary arts. No doubt triggered by, well, blood. Your blood, Dragon Of course here. it's my blood. Isn't the ancient blades we feared we would see with you. Why did you... Well, I guess if I'm using a dagger on myself, I would want to do as little damage to me as possible, and I guess using an iron dagger would be the least damage, so... Why did you pull a magical iron dagger out when you could have just used my dragon bone dagger? Anyways, when we get in here, let's check this out. Here we go, Nessus. Torches. What you're supposed to do with this thing. Okay, I'm stuck. was weird. Very, very, very weird. I got stuck in place. That was very clearly a glitch. Here is Alderman. This panel goes back to the beginning of time. An Alderman and the Dragon Cult. Here, the humans rebel against their Dragon Lord, the Lords, and the Jimsery Kraken War. Alderman's defeat is the centerpiece of the war. Now, you see, here is falling from the sky. The Nord talks, masters of the voice, are arrayed. So does it show how they defeated him? Isn't that why we're here? Ah, patient. The Akaviri were not a straightforward people. Everything is couched in allegory, myth and symbol. Yes, yes. This here, coming from the mouths of the Nord heroes, this is the Akaviri symbol for shout. But there's no way to know what shout is meant. You mean they used a shout to defeat Alduin? You're sure? Oh, yes. Presumably something rather specific to Dragon. Or even Alduin himself. Remember, this is the very good of Alduin. So we're looking for a shout then. Damn it. You ever heard of such a thing? A shout that can knock a dragon out of the sky? The bird beards might know, I guess. Right. I was hoping to avoid having to involve them in this, but it seems we have no choice. I'll ask this guy. Right. Good thing they've already let you into their little cult. Not likely they'd help Esbern or me if we came calling. We'll look around Skyhaven Temple and see what else the old blades might have left for us. It's a better hideout than I could have hoped for. Talos guards you. Do you need something? No, 
Into the third. Now, before leaving, viewers, something quick of note. If you come back here, you can grab the Dragon Bane. It is an enchanted blade sword that. Go to the Dragon's Bane. 40 points of extra damage to dragons, 10 points of shock damage to others. I do believe this is one of the non uh, de enchantable items, so. Are you paying attention? Don't try to do that, I guess. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll try anyways, but for the time being, I'm going to go on and head back to Dragon's Reach, because I got some shit to do there real quick. Next time, I'm... of course there's an enemy nearby, of course! Why can't there ever be anything other than an enemy nearby? Now, next time, I will be going to the one place that I can't pronounce and do that cavern. I do believe in that one you get the... Actually, I don't know what you get from that. God damn it! We fast travel already. Know what? Know what? You fucking know what? Become eternal! I'm, dead. I'm taking my fast way down! Uh. Oh, hey, it's Shadow Mirror. Heh! <laughs> How you doing? Can I fucking fast travel now? No, of course not. Alright. Like I was saying, I'm gonna track down where I've got that next area on the map, and I'll meet y'all over there. See ya.